Hello and welcome to ShowMeAcademy.com. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to change the default font in Microsoft Excel 2007. Here before me I have Excel open and I'm just going to type some uh, uh, default text here. Okay, there's our standard sentence for testing different fonts and you notice that uh, on the home tab, on the default tab that comes up in Excel, you have a number of different font options here um, where you can change the font, the size, the style, the color, the background color, etc. However, no matter what changes I make to this font, let's say that I very radically change the font, uh, let's say Berlin Sands, this is not going to have any effect on the font that will be used either in the rest of this document or when I create new documents or new spreadsheets. Of course, I could change the font even here on the entire spreadsheet if I wanted to. And now everything I type here will be in this new font. However, when I go to create a brand new worksheet, the worksheet will go back to my default font. Now the default font in Microsoft Excel is Arial when it comes out of the box. I happen to have reset mine to Calibri, which is a very common font for the rest of the Microsoft Office 2007 products. However, uh, usually you'll be seeing things in Excel uh, in Arial by default. But again, you may not want things to always be in Arial by default or in any other particular font. So you want to be able to change that so that every time you open a new spreadsheet, it can start in your own chosen default font. So again, we showed you here that you can change the font on any given cell or on the entire spreadsheet for that matter, but it's not going to have any effect when you go to create a brand new spreadsheet. So let me show you where we would change that setting. First of all, I'm going to close out of here and start fresh. So you can see our changes. And I'm going to first of all click on the Office button. The Office button is that multicolored uh, button that's always in the upper left hand corner of the Office 2007 products. And when I click on that, it's going to come up with this menu and I want to go to the Excel Options button here at the bottom. I'm going to click on that and you'll see here that it starts us off on the popular menu. There's a number of other menus that you can go to, but we will actually be working off the popular menu. And in the middle of this page, there is a When Creating New Workbooks section. And you see here that it has Calibri set by default right now. So every time I open a new spreadsheet, create a new spreadsheet, it will automatically set Calibri as being the default font. And this isn't just for the, uh, the data in the spreadsheet. It even affects some of the uh, data that outlines the rows and the columns. And I'll illustrate that for you here. Now let's say we want to change this. So I'm going to pick something else uh, that's radically different. Let's see, it's uh, going off the screen right now, but I'm going to go up here and click on Bauhaus 93. And when I do that, I'll click on the OK button at the bottom. And notice it comes up with this uh, alert here. It says, for your changes to the standard font to take effect, you must quit and then restart Microsoft Office Excel. So in other words, if I were to go right now and start to create new spreadsheets without restarting Excel, it would still have my default font of Calibri in place until I completely restart the application. So I'm going to click OK and I'm going to go ahead and shut down Excel and I will restart, open a new instance. And now notice things are starting to look drastically different. Notice the fonts here for my rows and my columns uh, much, look much different than they were before. And of course, anytime I type any data in here, going to all come up in the Bauhaus 93 font. Now again, just because this is set as the default doesn't mean that I can't manually go in and change cells or change spreadsheets as a whole. But if I type any new content where I haven't manually changed it, it's going to go back to my default font, which I had set at Bauhaus 93. Uh, of course, that's a rather ugly font to use as the default. So I'm going to go back to Excel Options. And let me resize this so you can see this better. 
And when I do this, I'm going to change this back to Calibri and click OK. Of course, it gives me the same warning again. It says I'll have to restart, restart Excel for these changes to take effect. I'll click OK. I will close down Excel. And I will restart. And now when I do, you'll see that by default, my font is set back to Calibri, which also changes the fonts for my rows and columns and all the data that I put in here. We'll go back to being in Calibri. That concludes this tutorial, and thank you for using showmeacademy.com.